Skip here with the Grand Auto. Uh, just wanted to do a quick background video for you on this 2015 GMC Yukon Denali. Uh, so I just took it on a test drive. Really nice ride. Uh, and it's a really nice uh, vehicle. So a lot of great features inside. We'll go through all that here in a minute. But I want to start off in the front here. So this does have the 6.28 uh, V8 uh, motor in it. Um, so you got plenty of power uh, to get everybody to where they need to go. Take a look at that, and it is cold today, so I'll just let you know I'm out here in the cold. But uh, yeah, it looks like I'm keeping it running just because it's cold. Um, but anyway, nice and clean on the inside here. So it looked like it had a little bit over a hundred thousand miles on it, so not bad. You can tell that you know that person went on a lot of road trips. There we go. A lot of road trips and stuff so i like that grill on the front here that chrome led lights up here park sensors too as well so they'll let you know when you're getting too close to something in the front um a little blemish here so i do point out blemishes in case you know just because i don't like surprises and i'm sure nobody else does i'm sure you don't so i want to make sure that you see everything before you come and take a look at it uh passive entry so you push the button to lock and then you press to unlock that gets you in and out of the vehicle that way you don't always have to pull out your key all right power seats on both sides here uh so that's really nice they're all they're also equipped with heated and ventilated up front uh you also have a heated steering wheel um one of the things that's great about the denali package is it does come with adaptive cruise control as well as um lane departure the adaptive cruise control on the 2015 is basically just going to beep at you when you're getting close to a vehicle um and then uh, the uh, lane departure will beep at you when you're crossing center lines and stuff uh, without using your blinkers. Bose radio sound system in here. In the back here, real comfortable. Seats recline and everything. They are also heated in the back, which is nice. Captain seats. You got climate controls back there for you. And like I said, again, they are also heated. And then there's ports back there to help for charging. DVD players there. Sunroof is also in the front. I forgot about that. And then everybody's got their own vents in the back. So there's vents on the ceilings everywhere. So they all got their own vents. Body is in really good condition. Now we get to the back here. Um, here's your here's your, here's your storage. So you got some storage underneath here. Of course, the seats do fold down too as well in case, you know, you have you have limited uh, passengers and stuff. You can fold the seats down and it gives you a little bit more room in case you have some stuff that you're hauling. But you can also press a button. Oops. Try this again. Oh, that's for that one. Okay, here we go. There we go. So you press a button to lower the back seats. This button here is to lower those seats up front here, or to, to fold them up, so it gives you a little bit more space. A really nice seat. It is cold. There's a little bit of stuff going on back here on the, on the bumper. Nothing really serious. Running boards are already on here too. Yeah, this is a really nice vehicle. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get this sent to you. We'll be in contact with you here soon and we'll see if we can't get something done. This also does come equipped with a remote start too as well, so that's also nice. But we'll, uh, we'll be in contact with you here shortly. See if we can get something done for you and then uh, yeah, have a good rest of your day. Thanks again for watching.